Good evening, y'all. My name is Tom here, and welcome back to my channel. Today we will be doing another unboxing videos. So, this is one of the most special aircraft that I received. Actually, not a real special one, but one of the world's largest passenger aircraft that is that I have for my model collection. Emirates Airlines is one of the, one of the most well-known, best profitable aircraft since Emirates have a lot of premium seats available and upgraded, which does comes with a showering. So Emirates Airlines gets the first A380 delivery on July 28th, 2008. It is one of the most well known, one of the best aircraft for Emirates Airlines. While for other airlines, airlines aren't very happy, too happy about getting that aircraft. So this airline is based in Middle East, which is in United Arab Emirates. So Without any further ado, let's dive into the unboxing video. Good evening, y'all. My name is Tom here, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we will be doing another unboxing videos. So, this is one of the most special aircraft that I received actually not a real special one but one of the world's largest passenger aircraft that is that I have for my model collection Emirates Airlines is one of the, one of the most well-known best profitable aircraft since Emirates have a lot of premium seats available and upgraded which does comes with a showering. So Emirates Airlines gets the first A380 delivery on July 28th, 2008. It is one of the most well known, one of the best aircraft for Emirates Airlines. While for other airlines, airlines aren't very happy, too happy about getting that aircraft. So. This airline is based in Middle East, which is in United Arab Emirates. So, without any further ado, let's dive into the unboxing video. Here's the main fuselage. This is one of the most well-known super jumbo jet of all aircraft. It is to compete one of the most well-known iconic aircraft, which is the Queen of the Skies, which is also for the Boeing 747. Here's the main fuselage. Very gorgeous, massive. Let's unbox the other section where it gets very interesting. Here's the giant wing span. That wing span is very gorgeous that it is almost the same length as the football field. Not to mention. That wingspan is a lot bigger than the Boeing 747 wingspan. Whoops. Sorry for a long 
for for a wait for a while. Here's the engines compared to the size of the 747 engines. These are either um, Rolls Royce Trend um, 800 or or GP 7000 on its engine. Please comment me if I was incorrect. Let's now install the engines on that mighty wing. Not to mention, it does have a very cool tiltable landing gear, which is very interesting. Here's the wing itself. Ta-da! That is one of the very nice aircraft viewing that I have. Now let's start assembling the wings and the fuselage. Here's the logo who or the name of the airline showing Emirates on its belly. Not a very easy fit, but this is how it ends up. Gorgeous. Here's a complete set of this aircraft. Now let's go for the stabilizer in the bottom stands right here this is how we will start doing a, another assembly I am kind of a little bit too lazy to use my hand to open it so instead I'm using a scissors That is a pretty big model stand here. Here's a big stand, model stand. There, it's done. Since it happens to my engines, I'm not going to put too much effort on using my finger, my hands. So instead I use a scissor. Look at this ginormous horizontal stabilizer. That horizontal stabilizer is is a lot bigger than any kind of regional aircraft wings. 
A few moments later. My inconvenience about the interruption during the unboxing video, but anyways, let's continue where we left off. This is the horizontal stabilizer. It is a lot bigger than any certain regional aircraft wingspan. No, no, not kidding. It is how this size was made. But let's start finishing off the assembling with its stabilizer. Here's one of it. Let's make a good final assembly for that mighty airplane. Ta-da! Now it's all done. It can roll. It has a pretty good details along with its sizing. Sadly, there is lack of details on the wings and some certain features on its fuselage. But hopefully, it's all good for now with that mighty airplane model that I have. To put into this end of this unboxing video, let's start putting onto a model stand. That's it. Here, here's the result. Very gorgeous airplane. So, before I'm going to end this video, please tell me more about that aircraft and that airline, about what makes this special and why Emirates chose to have that mighty super jumbo jet even for the other airlines that consider that this aircraft is a failure so please comment to me anything about what you know or have experience about this aircraft so hopefully make sure you like my video and i'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.